Hi guys, I'm Jojo Astro Barbie, Queen of Stars. How are you? Are you enjoying the summer? Isn't it wonderful? Welcome to your weekly horoscope. The sweet the sun is in the sign of Leo. Glamorous Leo, happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you, Leo. We love you because you wear a crown on your head and you are so cute. The moon this week will travel in the signs of Cancer, Leo, Virgo, and Libra. And on Tuesday, a big day, we have a fabulous, extraordinary, spectacular new moon in the sign of Leo. And also Mars, planet of energy and war in the sign of Scorpio that's been retrograding for quite many many months for the last time we'll leave Scorpio to finally re-enter Sagittarius for quite a long time until the end of 2017 putting all the energy in a strange place where it was about in March in 2016 in the beginning of the year and giving us back some kind of power, the wisdom to truly know how to push on our projects, on our goals, on our dreams. So we're getting our mojo back and more flow in the energy. On Monday, we also have a very fiery trine. That's a good aspect between Saturn, planet of wisdom in Sagittarius and the sun in the very royal sign of Leo, helping us to be very bold, taking risks, and to push on who we are, on our projects, especially the ones that we've been sort of putting off and procrastinating and putting away. Now we're back in the game and here we go to win big, big, big. Somehow this new energy of this trend also strengthens our energy. It makes us more positive, optimistic and daring. A very good time this week because of the new moon for new beginnings and to really make things right and to put things in the good side of history, the good side of humanity. If you do things for the better good of you, the people you love and also the world, you will succeed greatly. If not, you'll have some problems. Friday, Venus, planet of love, will step out of Leo. That's sort of fun because Venus loves to be in Leo. It's so romantic, passionate, sexy to enter the sign of Virgo, which is definitely more intellectual, practical, perfectionistic, and it will sort of make romance less sentimental, less sexy, less passionate, but more, more practical, more serious, but also ready for commitments. And the secret in the love department this week is really to be one's best friend, to have a fabulous romantic relationship with ourselves. Remember, we attract what we are. So this is the time to really love ourselves with everything we have. Reach out and helping other people is also very rewarding this week. The more we give, the more we receive. And somehow, remember, we're all one soul humanity. And truly, the secret to happiness is to remember that we are here and born to serve. Because everything else after that, it will be taken care of. It's not about what's good for me, it's about what's good for us. So let me start with you, Leo. I love you. Mm -hmm. Happy birthday to you. The new moon in your sign, Talam, makes you shine like a star. So it brings a fresh start and also a strong confidence. And Mars, planet of energy entering your creative house, gives you wings, especially in your personal life. So if you're single, you can meet somebody or really get to know some new friends that really enrich your life. Venus planet of love also entering your money sector brings gains, brilliancy, new ideas, and a possibility of a promotion and making some changes in career. Get ready to be very popular in the love department. And if you are in transition between thinking of maybe breaking up, it's a good week to start legal activities or to tell your partner what are your intentions. I would clear the air this week. There's also more flow towards the end of the week, like Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, you feel good and on the weekend, it's truly a time to celebrate the brand new you because you're doing very good. Cancer, 
Gemini and Sagittarius, so definitely our allies. Your magical color is gold. Lucky numbers 1 and 10. Ta da! Play lottery. Virgos! The new moon in your spiritual sector makes you creative, intuitive, and Venus, blessed of love, entering your sign, make you quite cute, charming, lovable, popular, and magnetic. Everywhere you go, people smile at you. Mars entering your home sector makes you sort of able to take care of business and your health and your looks and you see things clearly about your future. In romance, you get answers to your many questions these days and for the next couple of weeks, it's very good to spend more time with yourself. You could be out there promoting yourself because Venus and your sign makes you popular, but do take some time for yourself, for your creative projects and for your ideas and with your family. On the weekend, reading motivational books, go to seminars and watch funny movies definitely is the best thing to inspire you, my lovely beauties. Your magical color, mauve lucky number, 7 and 43. Ta-da! Libra, the new moon in your social sector brings you popularity and luck. And Venus, your ruler, entering your spiritual house brings a new awareness of who you are, what you want to accomplish, and also compassion for other people. For the next couple of weeks, it brings more peace and harmony into your life, and Mars entering your communication house brings protection, a gift with words, the ability to write, and also very good relationships with friends and partners. Romance also could bring unusual people in your life. So if you're a bachelor, you're single, you could meet somebody from another culture, another country. So have fun with this. And just in, on the weekend, just enjoy because joy is definitely on your menu. Your magical color, lilac, lucky numbers, 8 and 17. Ta-da! Scorpio, Scorpio, the new moon in your career sector brings power, creativity, confidence, and Venus, planet of love, entering your social house makes you very, very popular. You feel better about yourself. You're in a new way of being, and it's really, really good. So, this week, ask, and you shall receive. Mars, your ruler, leaving your sign to return to your money sector, Sagittarius, will bring also a new hope in your heart and your mind, and protection and luck. So believe in your luck and just bless the past and remember everything happens for a reason. You are definitely moving up in the world. You'll feel the difference in energy this week. Love could also come from when you're traveling or maybe on the workplace. So if you're single, <laughs> magic awaits. Definitely you feel more confidence this week about special relationships in your personal life. Follow your heart, not your head in everything you do. That's a secret. On the weekend, you feel definitely on top of the world and you feel appreciated by many loved ones and even strangers. Aries, Cancers are definitely your best allies. Your magical color red, lucky numbers 8 and 17. Sagittarius, we have big news for you. The new moon in your travel sector makes you very spiritual and also more aware of who you are, what you want. Venus, planet of love, entering your career house brings recognition and new ideas to make more money, to be more financially independent. And it makes you more closer to friends. Everything to do with traveling, moving, favored. Teamwork definitely is the best way to get results in career. And when you reach out to the powers that be to ask for a promotion or a new way of doing things, you will get a yes. Your family and loved ones show they care this week and it makes you feel very special. And on the weekend, you feel happy and blessed. So do count your blessings. Your magical color fuchsia, lucky numbers one and ten. Capricorn, the new moon in your shared resources sector, make you powerful, confident, and Venus, planet of love, entering your karmic house. Bring a new you, a new self-image, a new confidence in yourself. You want to reinvent yourself in every way and do it. Mars entering your spiritual sector also brings benefits from a partner or a family member. In career, you feel appreciated, and in your health, this is a department that you really are blessed with. Everything is more stable. Any beauty treatment, any surgery, or anything to do with being the best you could be in health, favored all week. On the weekend, the occult will inspire you, and you could even get psychic dreams, so check it out. Your magical color, orange, lucky numbers, two and 11. Aquarius, the new moon in your relationship sector, bring you high energy and optimism and joie de vivre. If 
Venus planet of love and human social resources definitely bring prosperity, promotions, acceptance from people, popularity, and feeling really good about who you are. You get along very well with family and friends, partnerships, and also marriage is favored. So if you want to really tie the knot this week, that's a good time to make a commitment. Somehow also you attract special new people in your life. So just when you go places, just connect with all kinds of new strangers coming in your life. In the weekend, surrender to romance because romance wants you. Hmm. Your magical color, purple, like your numbers 8 and 44. Pisces, the new moon in your work sector make you feel very happy and confident. And Venus, planet of love entering your house of relationship brings peace and joy in your friendships and romance. Your life is changing for the better. Do you feel it? And Mars entering your career house brings hope, bring truth, power. I mean, you're moving forward in career and you're getting new deals coming up and you like it. On the weekend, count your blessings and share your blessings with others. Well, you're good at that anyways. Your magical color fuchsia, like in numbers 9 and 45. Aries, the new moon in your romantic sector brings happy feelings and popularity in romance and social life. You have strong emotions and deep feelings these days. And Venus planet of love during your workhouse brings some good results, recognition, success. You're closing the deal, signing contracts. You're doing really good. And Mars, your ruler, entering your travel house brings also a sense of freedom and more flow in everything you do in your life. This is a very good time to get closer to the people you love. On the weekend, open your heart, share, share, share. People want to show you how much they care for you. Your magical color red, like in numbers 2 and 11. Ta da! Taurus, the new moon in your home sector increases your popularity, intelligence, and sense of business. Venus, your ruler, entering your romantic house makes you even more popular. Everybody wants a piece of you. You feel closer to people you love, and you're very popular if you're single and if you're a bachelor. I mean, love is in the air. Just have fun. Show up and be gorgeous. You are gorgeous. You are a Taurus. You are ruled by Venus, right? planet of beauty and charm and sensuality. Mars entering your shared resources sector brings protection and gains and new ideas at work. You see tangible results in career. Believe in yourself, believe in your luck because now you are moving in a new path of true abundance and freedom. On the weekend, get ready for tenderness, sensuality, I told you. Venus is doing this to you. So say yes, I like it. Your magical color green, like in numbers 3 and 21. Gemini's, the new moon in your communication sector make you very confident and brilliant. You have definitely higher energy. Venus entering your home house brings you closer to family, partners, associates, and friends. And you feel appreciated. And you feel more like in the flow. You're definitely in a good mood and you're energized, you feel confident, and you're not taking no for an answer. A good time to push on your special projects, on your ideas, to connect with people, make the phone calls, write the emails, the texts, all these things, because people are listening and you're able to break through. Anything to do also with family gatherings, with friends, are favored all the week long. So that's the full bloom of the summer, so go out with friends and have fun, and look good, and be glamorous, and put makeup, and put sexy clothes on. And somehow taking uh, the time to spend time with nature, to go for hikes, to walk on the beach, to go in nature or in the forest, it's very, very healthy for you. Yoga, sports, exercise, massage also is fabulous, especially on the weekend. Your magical color yellow, lucky numbers 4 and 22. Ta da! Cancer, the new moon in your financial sector, gives you wings and hope for the future. Venus, planet of love, entering your communication house make you popular, assertive, charming, very sexy, hard to resist, push on your goals and ask and you will definitely have people do things for you. Mars entering your work sector brings also possibilities of unknown, unseen breakthroughs out of the blue. Recognitions and gains definitely await. And make sure you look the part because powers that be are watching. Even the ones you don't know. You feel powerful, and you feel invincible and so be bold and just fight for what you want 
make a wish because I promise you cancers, it will be granted. It's so much fun to have. Ooh, it's those beautiful planets in your second house of finances. I'm a cancer, I love it. Tell them, financial freedom. On the weekend, focus on your desires and wishes and be spectacular the way you dream. And people will also applaud the way you walk and the way you dress. You'll have a lot of compliments. Your magical color red, lucky like numbers five and 23. And now is your wizard affirmation of this fabulous week with that beautiful, beautiful new moon in Leo. Happy feelings. <sighs> Feeling happy will always attract more happy circumstances. Like I always say, you focus on the happy, you manifest happy. You focus on the unhappy and the dark, you will manifest more. So we could create our life the way we think, the way we talk, the way we feel. So feel happy. Love you guys. See you next week. Enjoy this beautiful new moon.